please consider supporting me on Patreon for me to continue creating these videos. Also, you get the coolest stuff over there like a free persistent graphics menu or some cool materials. Hello everyone, welcome to another video and today I wanted to show you how you can create, how you can make your lighting volumetric. So what we've got here is just a basic scene, actually quite basic, with just some trees and some rocks from the uh, guide demo, so they are freely available if you need some nature assets. But what we're going to do is we're going to go to the mode step and just search for exponential height fog. Once you drop it in you can see a slight change, not too much, but the fog density will be increased to 0.5. Now as you can see this doesn't look really good at all, you can't see a thing anymore. That's because, well, just wait. We can go down and enable volumetric fog. As you can see, we can see a lot more. And you can already kind of see the uh, god rays going through. It's really hard to see, but you can kind of see it. What we need to do here is actually go to the light source increase this to I like to increase to 15 if it's a bit and because it just looks better and as you can see there are much more god rays looks quite nice and you can go to your exponential height fog maybe change some settings Let's just leave that at the uh, standard. So as you can see, looks really nice. But there might be a small problem. You, when you look at the sun, you don't really see God rays at all. Why is that? Well, because we don't have a bloom effect for the God rays. If we were to enable light shaft bloom, as you can see, when we look at the sun, it's also, let me quickly make this a bit yellowish for a nice tint. You can also better see the gold rays while still having this volumetric effect, and I didn't actually change the bloom tint. There we go. And finally, let's just change up the fog here fog scattering color let's just make this a bit more yellowish okay let's keep that on blue as you can see looks really nice i have a better scene to demo it but this is basically how you set it up and you can just play around with some settings and make it better for enable for instance enable occlusion i don't really like this effect but if you do enable it if you don't like me disable it you can increase the bloom score you can decrease the bloom score you can set a threshold i think i had it on minus that and then with two and that looks quite good Uh, let me open up my cliff scene might have seen this from Twitter or my patreon page as you can see it just looks really nice coming through the trees and such and it's really nice that uh, previously sun rays just vanished when you didn't look at them and now they just stay because it's volumetric so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you on the next one this is just a quick one but well bye bye